Over the top. Well, there's a communication break down there. Appears from Garnett for the back pass. That was the danger. Abdallah. Here's the ball over the top, and why not? Semenya the target. Well, that's why he got away with it. Not a deliberate back pass. It did, in, in his defence, seem to come off his thigh. Very hard to control the football with your thigh. So I think that's why the referee, Abdelaziz Blue, gave Abdallah the benefit of the doubt. Three minutes to half time. Well, that's a regulation time. Don't anticipate too much stoppage time. Here come Kama Race. It's a superb one. Will he go all the way? What a goal! Oh my word! That's the way to make it end luck. A moment of magic from Marlena. It's his second goal in as many games. Oh, would you believe it? Absolutely sensational run. The home fans are ecstatic. The Italian coach keeps him up on his feet. Well, he's keeping a poker face, but I bet deep down inside, he's delighted. Those fans certainly are. But the goal seems to come from nowhere and nothing. Kind of seems to be in a good position. And then that leads up, well, he had other ideas. Then I was just saying, it would be a superb time to score a goal. Anytime you do so, just before half-time, it's a psychological hammer blow for the opposition. And there he is. Bohan starts it, picks it up 25 metres out, beats one, beats two, goes past the third, pulls the trigger, one nil. Thank you very much. Fantastic footwork and a lovely balance. Well, that is one of the best goals I'm sure he'll ever score. It's certainly one of the best goals we've seen in qualifying in the African zone, these two match phase. And you'll have to go some way to better it throughout the whole World Cup qualifying campaign. Of that, I'm sure. Well, Ghana patiently waiting for Camarose to get back into their own half. Waiting for the just to set up. And now we can restart. Rizia Malida. Two goals in as many games. And would you believe that before the game on Friday, that young man hadn't played a competitive game since last spring. He's back in the German Bundesliga. 